School is back in session, and the class I'm teaching this semester got me thinking about the true job of a fashion designer. And I have to say, there's more to it than I think most people realize. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Mikkel Drew Pelham. I am a digital fashion educator teaching digital fashion design and communication through my company, 383 Design Studio, as well as as an adjunct professor at the Fashion Institute of Technology. So what is the job of a fashion designer? Let me know in the comments what you believe the job entails. I'll tell you what I think most people think it is. Coming up with creative designs all day long, shopping, drawing pretty pictures, and yes, I'm being sarcastic with that last one. But the consensus is that we spend our days just being creative. And in fact, there's so much more that you need to do as a designer that being creative, at least in the sense that most people think about creativity, tends to be the smallest part of our jobs, especially if you have your own brand. When you really think about what a designer does, it's more about being a creative visionary and master communicator. So creative visionary, I think is understood and everyone expects that part. You come up with ideas, concepts, designs, but it's the communication part that is a little less expected. I posted on Instagram the other day that being able to convey your creative vision is just as important as having and creating one. It takes a village, as they say, to execute your vision. And for you, that village is your team. And your team might not be assistants and associates that work directly under you. Your team might consist of manufacturers, suppliers, freelancers, an accountant, your lawyer. Those are the people that are making the dream work. But the dream, the vision comes from you and you need to be able to clearly communicate that vision to your team so they can help you execute it. So what does that entail? In our world, our communication is mostly visual and we communicate those visuals with sketches or drawings and then eventually a tech pack so that the rest of your team can then create prototypes and samples, execute a photo shoot, create marketing materials, etc. But it all starts with you. And this is why I'm always so passionate and adamant about designers understanding how to draw at least a flat sketch and knowing how to use digital fashion design software and tools which are designed to help you visually communicate your vision even more clearly and comprehensively. And when it comes to the tech pack, even if you're not the one who is filling out the Excel BOM or uploading sketches to PLM, it's your design and no one knows better than you how you want something to look. A manufacturer can help guide you in terms of the execution or what finish might be best, but you, the designer, need to know what you want your design to look like and you must be able to let your team know. So the designer's job is not just relegated to the creative idea person. You're also a bit of a creative strategist and that requires much more than just being creative. Your job as a designer is responsible for clearly communicating to the rest of the team what those designs should look like, how they should be executed, what colors and fabrics you see them in. You work with your sourcing team or mills and suppliers to get the right fabric at the right price at the right time so your products are delivered to a warehouse or a store or make the shipping window on time. You're, you work with your marketing team to make sure they've got the right understanding of your vision for the season so the marketing materials make sense with the seasonal strategy. You even work with your merchandising team to choose the assortment and understand what styles are working, what's not, what you should or should not bother designing, and what styles will be offered together. And then you'll work with the manufacturer or a production team to make sure that your designs are priced so your customer feels they're affordable to them. You're the one who initiates everything, especially if it's your brand. The rest of the team are taking their cues from you, the designer. So it's important that they clearly understand the vision and goals for the season and for the brand. All of that requires thought, planning, strategy, much more than just drawing pretty pictures and shopping all day, although we get to do that too. 
And when you're ready to disseminate that information to your team, you'll use your fashion design software, whether that's Adobe Illustrator, Photoshop, InDesign, Browseware, Clo, Style 3D, a PLM system to do your version of show and tell to communicate the vision for the season. Thanks for watching today's video. If you need to get better at communicating your creative vision, whether that's through digital design or getting better understanding a tech pack, make sure you check the links in the description to my digital fashion design school and online courses. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video if you find it helpful. Have a fantastic week and I'll see you next time.